Alright, so this was the cave that I slept in. Uh, we'll just look at a bunch of stuff. It's not a big fire, but it's comfortably warm in here, and the smoke has a very pleasant, very mellow texture to it. It's very mellow, bruh. There are tunnels extending down into the earth behind the screen. Oh, that's cool. Uh, oh, a mushroom uh, seat. That's cute. <laughs> Psychedelic furniture. I know some people at home would go crazy mm. about stuff like that. Psychedelic furniture. Oh, my God. All right, let's see here. Uh, can't look at these. Uh, bed. Not the most comfortable bed I've slept in, but acceptable. What about you? What do you think about you, April? I look like a serving maid. Oh, you look fine, honey. All right, I guess we'll head out. Oh, oh. oh. she's awake. April. Banda. Hello. Or uh, but Ben Ben Bon Ben Bondu. I think his name was. Good morning, Ben Bondu. Eh. Yeah. Greetings of the new day to you, April. Did you sleep well in the spirit dig? Did I sleep well? Aside from the voices, the apparitions, the sharp rocks poking me in the back, and the moist moss mattress? No, not really. <laughs> so you were visited by the spirits? I guess. When you told me last night that I would be, I didn't believe you. I thought it was just a manner of speaking, like saying, don't let the bed bugs bite. Our ancestors are close to us at all times. Once in a while, they speak to those who have been chosen to spend a night in the spirit dig. That they spoke to you is a great honor. Mm -hmm. April, a great honor. <laughs> right now, I'd be happy to exchange all the honor in the world for one decent night's sleep. <laughs> oh, dear me. You are very funny, April. If all humans are as funny as you, your cities must be filled with laughter. The Elder wishes to speak with you again. And I must sing now, down in the tunnels. It was decided this morning that I was finally ready to join the diggers. Oh, fun. Good for I'm you. I'm happy for you, Ben Bondu. Hell yeah. Thank you. May the balance provide you on your journey, April. You will be in my heart always. And you will be in mine, Ben Bondu. Aww. Always. You will come back when your journey is over. You'll I'll be try. in my Bye. heart. No oh matter my. what they say. I cannot say. stand farewells. Oh. But farewell. Oh. Ben. What the hell is that thing? <laughs> it's a Bondu. It's a Bonda. They're great. They're little, like, little forest, um, Sasquatches. <laughs> the spirit dick? Who the fuck is this nerd? <laughs> So Ben Bondu was, uh, we found him in a forest and he was looking for his brother. His brother was captured by the witch who we burned alive in the pot. Um, so we saved his brother. And now he was, like, eternally grateful. And this thing, Elder Mole, well, I guess they're moles. Okay. Anyway, um, uh, that, the, the Elder was like, oh, sleep in the bed and you'll be visited by the spirits and all this stuff. So we will talk to the Elder, I guess. So, you are awake? Did you sleep well? As well as can be expected, I guess. Does the word Buckbar mean anything to you? Buckbar? Where did you hear this word? Uh, nowhere. <laughs> oh. Parrots! I'd heard it in a dream. The spirits told me I had a Buckbar. Uh, sure. The spirits told me that I'd had a buck bar. So Mr. Ollivander! <laughs> spoke to you openly? You are lucky, human. Heck yeah. Some who enter the spirit dig never come out again. And what? Spend the night Excuse me? Nothing. But to you, what? the spirits spoke. You took that risk? A buck bar is I could have died? That speaks the truth in uh, I'm not, ways. not so much a fan of the bond anymore. One Jesus. the dark truth. This is how you see yourself when you are not sure of yourself or angry with yourself. Mm. The other truth is the very opposite of the first. This is how you must see yourself to be happy. Mm. But the spirits remind us that both are important. That you cannot love yourself without first seeing your flaws. Mm. The people I saw 
Were they really there? The spirits use masks to convey their messages, and they speak in voices from the past or the present that carry great weight with you. The messengers are never the same, nor the message. But you must take care to hear and heed their words. Okay. I was told that my name among the Banda would be April Bandu Mbata. Hmm. She among the little ones who seeks and finds. That's like every adventure so game in a nutshell. <laughs> you are the one we sing of. The human who would come to aid us and to save our world. And who will then tear it apart. Yeah, what is what does that you mean? You bring tidings both happy and sad to the Banda, April Bandu and Bata. Both hope and despair. Despair! This world will never be the same again once you have passed through Fucking it. Fucking Duncan Rumpa music Chris playing. But burr, 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 burr. And I'm proud to have met you yeah. and to give you what you came for. It was just luck that brought me here. I didn't come for anything in specific. One chooses the wizard, Mr. Yes, Potter, but you, you can did. choose my wand any time. Oh, my. This is what you came for. Uh, oh, 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 she gave me something. What did you give me? Oh. What is it? I don't know. This is the stone given to us by This is a rock. <laughs> to keep safe until it's my this pet. day. It has been with us for so long. Oh, it's a piece of the disc. Mm. Then you know it. Mm -hmm. You came for the stone, even though you didn't know it until now. Indeed. I guess I did. Thanks. Now, you must continue your journey, April Bandu and Bata. Okay, that's good. Remember that this is your tribe now. And so you are welcome at our fires and in our digs whenever you come this way again. Hmm. I'm honored. Thank you. That's awesome. May there always be soil between your toes, April Bandu and Bata. And between yours, Elder. Goodbye. I love it. Lord Dragon? It's it's a little bit. It's a little bit like uh, Wheel of Time. <laughs> so I, oh. so I got a disc. That's good. Bonda Stone. Can I look at it? It's a piece of the stone disc I got from the Banda people. So the stone disc was, I, I believe, fractured into three. Um, so the stone disc is something I need to place at an altar at some point. Um, and then I also need to, I need to compile the stone disc, like I'll, I'll get all the pieces together, put it in the altar, get the guardian, get him to fucking sit there, um, and then we fix the world. <laughs> Sounds a little bit like Leela. From uh, Futurama? Futurama? There's Wake she... up! She uh. do... I guess she does kind of. Hey, Crow. Hey, buddy, old Turn pal. off the big light, mommy. Oh, my. It's called the sun, Crow. Welcome to the world of the living. Bitch! <laughs> oh. Hmm. <laughs> I was having this weird dream about a big ass turkey wearing a pair of red shoes, and you were there, and and he was there, and 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 maybe it wasn't a dream after all. Uh, I think it's safe to say that you need therapy, and we need to leave right now. Oh, wow, rude, April. We Jeez. Do. We do. Let's go get him. Where are we going? <clears throat> uh, who are we getting again? Exactly. Some evil alchemist out to rule the world with his powerful and destructive magic. Evil alchemist? Oh. Yes, exactly! Uh, I'll keep an eye out for other potential <laughs> threats then, shall I? Like, uh, marauding mice? Sure. You do that, Crow. You do that. Thank you. What, what was the alchemist? I don't remember that. Oh, we're gonna do the cutscene? Oh, okay. Uh, what did April write in her journal? Her diary. Hmm. I got the first stone. It's funny. I came here by chance, and I didn't even know the Bondo were guarding one of the pieces of the disc, yet here it is, right in my hand. It's a lot smaller than I thought, which is a good thing, considering I'll be carrying it with me for a while. <clears throat> this is not so hard, is it? I'm actually starting to enjoy myself, of course. Uh, having said that, everything will probably go wrong from now on. <laughs> Three more stones, and I'm home free. Oh, four stones, okay. After I defeat the evil alchemist, of course, and hold the forces of Chaos at bay, and... Oh boy. I really gotta keep a positive attitude here. 
What's this about an alchemist? Uh... Okay, yeah, no, I already did that one. Um... <clears throat> I don't remember the alchemist step. Need a friend, he's very funny. Uh huh. Okay, well. Ah, it's fine. I just have. I, I know I have to go to an alchemist. So that. that oh, leave him. Why do you have the soul of Scotty Evil? What? It's stuck inside a crow. <laughs> I don't know who Scotty Evil is. Oh, wait. Do you mean, like, Dr. Evil's son? Because that's fair. <laughs> Alright, um. Oh, I can go to, just go to the swamp. Alright, uh. It's the and Elder Bondu. Okay. Anything else I can grab? I don't think so. Let's go! That's. Alright, I guess we're going that way. Oh! Where the fuck am I? Oh, I'm right there. God, Jesus. Um, let's look at the water. Swamp water. There are things moving down there. Big things. <laughs> Shock in the water. <laughs> Swamp water. Swamp water. Uh, that's fair. Yeah, he is a little bit like Scotty. Mosquitoes. Mosquitoes everywhere. <laughs> I hope one of those clouds doesn't get a whiff of me in charge. The last thing I need now is malaria. Uh, up to the hill? Anywhere else? No, okay, up to the hill. Hello? Larry is gone. Uh, a floating castle! Uh, okay. Hello? That must be Roper Clax's castle. The whole gravity defying bit kind of gives it away. What? I wonder if that's like the Arcadian equivalent of an RV. I mean,. I wouldn't think relocation is a big problem. Uh, okay. I can just see it. Okay, but I just go back down? Oh, what the fuck? Hello? A statue. Oh. This is terrifying. Oh, is he holding up the castle? No, dog, Larry, it's like the number one thing you gotta worry about when you go to Central America. So that's uh, fair enough. Absolutely fair. Uh. Hello? Nice stonework. Not particularly realistic. Are you kidding me? It looks terrifying. Strange texture. My fingers feel tingly. Mm. Ah! Mm. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mm. He was medusa What are you? I don't know. I have no idea. Mm. I don't understand what you're saying. Can you try to open your he mouth? He can't, please? April. <laughs> Impossible. Okay. Impossible? Okay. Okay, there's gotta be some way to help you talk. By the way, can you help me get up there? Into the castle? Why would I want to go there? <laughs> your arms can't move. Need magic. I don't know any magic. And whatever. <laughs> but I'll try to find a way to soften you up. Oh, my. Thank you. <laughs> Okay. Well, that's good to know, I guess. Can I... Those Oosh. berries look ripe and juicy, but my mom taught me never to judge a book by its cover. They're probably poisonous and almost certainly fattening. But... Almost certainly fattening? What? What kind of berries do you eat? <laughs> Let me pick some berries. Nah, uh That marshy ground between me and the berries looks treacherous. Huh. I'll probably get stuck and drown. Uh, I don't care. Nope, the marshland's too dangerous to be wandering around in. Boo. Those berries look ripe and juicy. So, okay. Uh-oh, I'm sinking. Oh, no. Oh. Now, that was a bit scary. I could have lost my shoes. And I guess my life. Wait, can I actually die in this game? Hold on. I need to test this theory. I haven't been I haven't had been able to to do anything like that. Uh, let's see if here. Let's let's see if I can die. I look like a serving maid. Oh, I actually can't. God damn it. April, come on. I want... Eh, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Uh, is there anything I can do to just, like, smack him? Uh, let's see. We got candy. Got a stone. I lost something. Huh. Can I, like, look at that or touch it? Or What if I hit him with this rock? 
The petrified man. Interesting. Uh, need magic. I mean, I don't really have any. I have a flute. What if I use the flute? Bird, will you help me? Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. What you got for me, buddy? Brr, it's chilly out here. You should really be wearing a sweater, doll. You don't want to catch a cold, not with the fate of the known cosmos on your shoulders. Hmm. I'm fine, thanks, Crow. What's going on with you? Mm -hmm. Keeping my eyes open, you know? Floating on the warm winds, doing that whole Hawkeye shtick? I'm getting pretty good at it, too. I spotted you from at least 100 yards away. Hmm. Impressive. Mm hmm. Yep. They don't call me <laughs> the Lord of the Winds for nothing. Nice. Do they really call you that? Mm-hmm. No, but soon, by the balance, they will. Now, what can I do for you, sweetheart? Uh... Oh, okay. All right, uh... What can I do you for? It's Crow. Can I touch him? Oh. So, oh, so he's an item. Oh, get the berries. You can fly over there. Crow, I need you to fly over there and get some of those berries for me. And Crow? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Don't eat the berries. No, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Alright. Well, what am I gonna do with berries? Thanks, Crow. You got it. I'm gonna go back up there and work on my eyesight. I ain't stopping until I can spot those cute chicks from miles and miles away. Okay, so... If he... If I need him, then he'll be up like... Then... He'll, uh... If I need to use him in the area, he'll, he'll come down. If I don't need him, he won't come down. So what do the... Berries? What can I do with berries? Can I, like, make a potion? I got a few of these ripe and sticky berries, but I don't want to carry them with me for much longer. The juice is coloring my pants. Okay. Can I eat them? I'm not particularly hungry. Can we, like, dye them on something? No? Okay. Well, I got berries now, I guess. So... Oh... I need to go back to the bridge, I think. Oh. Hello? Purple flowers. Let's pick them. They feel very soft to the touch and soothing like skin moisturizer. I'll yeah. bring a few in case my hands get dry. Never Ooh. hurts to be prepared for a dry skin emergency. All right, maybe I... Well, I mean, these are the same color, but... Oh, I do dye them. Oh. I made moisturizing cream. Oh. Okay. Do you want some moisturizing cream? <laughs> what am I gonna do with this? Okay. Um. All right. Uh. What the fuck am I gonna use that on? Uh. Moisturize me! Okay. Um. So. I spent half the day crossing that damn swamp, and I have no intention of going back that way until I have to. Oh! Wait, the petrified man. Maybe. Maybe he just needs some skin moisturized. I don't think that'll help, but... Doesn't hurt to try it. Hey, man. Because I literally can't go back, so... You want to see moisturizer? Oh, yeah. oh my god, that actually works. What the fuck? Moisturize me! There. You feel better? Soft, soft, softer. Yes. Oh. Unfortunately, I don't think the salve will be effective for very long. Oh. I'm April, by the way. Lorhan, I'm a sailor. 
and you've got to help me get out of here. I don't think I can stand it much longer. Well, he's another character in this game. What happened to you? What happened to you? Oh, that blasted, blasted alchemist cast a spell on me, turned me to solid rock. Then he put me here to be gatekeeper and anchor for his blasted castle. That was near six full moons past now. Damn. You've been here for half a year? Curse the bounce. When you say it like that, it is an age. My wife is sure to have taken someone else's bed by now. Oof. Blasted magic. The vanguard were right. Hmm. What do you mean the vanguard were right? What do you mean the vanguard were right? That we've been at the mercy of the balance for too long. It's time to make some changes. Put the control back into the hands of the people. Hmm. How would that have helped you? Well, for one, there wouldn't be any rogue magicians like this Roper Clax running about causing trouble. Mm. Do you not agree? I'm not about to argue politics with you right now, Lorhan. I'm in a hurry. Who's arguing? And blasted be my rocky hide. Get me out of here. How can I help you? It ain't just me, April. There are dozens of men up there. Servants and sailors and merchants and soldiers. All sent here by their masters to deal with Roper Clax. Oh, <laughs> okay. Cursed be the balance. We've all been turned to stone, and our mm. souls trapped in a crystal that the madman keeps in his tower. Damn. He draws power from that. Power that shouldn't be his by right. Mm. But this blasted problem of the balance he really is the natural order of the things. Word. If the Vanguard were in control, this would never have happened. Things would be like they used to be a long time ago. Mm. Everything was good then? Hmm. Oh, sure, there were problems, but this rift, it ain't natural. Science and magic belong together in the hands of the people. Not to some naked guardian fellow on a tower somewhere far away. See, that's interesting. I Listen, wondered about that. we've got that. more important things to think about, like how I'm going to get inside the mountain. Beat like, I, I wondered if it was going to be a, a power yeah, thing. Yeah, you're right. And I can feel my muscles turning to stone again. Yeah, crystal? Yeah, hurt. a little bit. <laughs> how do I get inside the mountain? I'll pull the stairs down for you. Usually when Clax comes and goes, he softens me up for a bit. Just so I can raise and lower the stairs for him, and then he changes me back to solid rock again. Wow, what a jerk. Once you're inside, and if you manage to defeat the madman, I don't see how you're gonna do that, a young woman like yourself. Wow, rude. I'm pretty resourceful, and I'm not your run of the mill teeny bopper either. <laughs> teeny bopper. You're what? Anyways, if you defeat Clax, you must find his study and break the crystal, the soul stone. That should break the spell and give us back our flesh and bone bodies. Okay. Sounds like a plan. All right, here goes. Watch your head, April. Oh, oh, he's, he's, look, he's bringing it down. Oh. Okay. Nice. Where did I, where did I go? Let's see, what did I do? What did I write? Tuesday afternoon, August 1st. Having spent most of the day traversing a horrid swamp filled with foul odors, hungry tentacle thingets, and tons of sticky stuff, that's okay, <laughs> I finally arrive at the foot of Roper Clax's castle late in the afternoon. The guy's got like the most amazing mansion, and it levitates too. If it weren't for this petrified guy, Lorhan, it would just fly off into the clouds. So Lorhan tells me that Roper Clax has trapped a lot of people in his castle and that he keeps their souls in a so-called soul stone. Very original, typical evil magic guy stuff. <laughs> if I manage to break this soul stone, everybody will be turned back into soft and flexible humans. Or whatever they were to begin with. Again with the saving people thing. It's gonna be a habit or what? The soul stone? Thanks! Sexy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say sexy about the, the the swamp thing. I was like, that's my mind went in, the, in in a different direction than April, uh, evidently. All right, let's go meet Roper Clax, I guess. Hop, hop, hop. Mm, what the fuck is this thing? Oh, a labyrinth. Great. I so love these things. Oh no, thank you. Jump, jump into the abyss. No. Who is that? Wait. Don't tell me, evil wizard. Hope they not. all sound like Richard the Third on crack. <laughs> what? I love it. Okay. Uh, gargoyle. He's got his hand out like he's begging. Oh. He wants something. You want this? Hourglass? That gargoyle's holding a large hourglass. Can I take it? I don't think I can reach him.
Oh, is it time? It is. Oh, ooh. It. Whoa, my God! Oh, Leah, Leah, hello! Ah, every time I'm gonna, I'm gonna remember how to pronounce it. How are you, Leah? Hello, hello, Leahitum. How are you too? I hope you're all well. Hello. <laughs> How was, um, I think you were playing, uh, Sea of Thieves when I had to leave for work, or leave from work. How was that? Benji, would you mind giving a shout out, by the way, to, uh, Last Exit Ahead? Yeah, 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 yeah. How was that? Oh, let me make sure I can see the chat. Uh. Hello, 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 Ice Nine. Nice, nice to meet you. Uh, stream change? Melvin! Hi, Melvin. Right, which one is this took one? me back to where Ash didn't have a hitbox. And oh. I don't want to be reminded of that. <laughs> where are you? Where the fuck are you? Oh no! What happened? Uh, uh, guys? <laughs> no, just like slowly crawled next. Oh no. <laughs> Stream change? Yeah, so I, I'm. Uh, it's a very heavy work week for me right now, so I had to stream a little bit later. Um, but I'll still be going the three hours. Um, it was good. I got betrayed by my crew. Oh no. And they put me in the brig and I got mad at them and my anger made a crack in the pier. <laughs> Release the kraken. Very nice. <laughs> Malfin, they killed the piggy. Lace crew were evil pirates. Nice. Nice. <laughs> uh... That's awesome. I need to freaking buy a CFD. It looks like just a bunch of fun. Just a... Oh, okay, so I can leave. Do I have to do something to the hourglass? Because he, it just... I can't do it. I can't go anywhere else, I think. Oh, oh. A door. Because I can move this, but it never stays. Because it's magically inclined. What a jerk. What a- what a jerk! Um, alright, so what do- Well, I- I can't go back to the swamp, so there must be- there must be something that I can do here. Because the game doesn't really trap me. Parchment? Look at this. It's a rolled up parchment. Okay. I can't get at it, though, because the stairs won't do the thing. Uh, can I give something to the gargoyle? What would the gargoyle- oh, wait. Would th this would be kind of weird. I mean, it's it's a time-related thing. Could I... Come on, let me click it. Let me click it! There we go. Could I give that... Get out of here. To the gargoyle? No. What could I do to... Reverse it? Uh, band of, bond of stone, calculator... Coins... Push pin... What could I... Do, do I, do I need to give the gargoyle money? Ah, money. Sways every beast. There you go. Oh. Uh, flaming hand. Oh, okay. Uh, can, can I eat it? Oh, I can just blow it up. Oh. And now I can go here. Is that what they're suggesting? Whoa. Oh. I'm not afraid of heights, but this... This is kind of scary. Ooh. Something tells me that door down there is important. Hmm. How am I going to get to it? Good question. Jump! Jump into the abyss! I don't want to jump! You crazy old man! Um... Ready to give up? Oh. Toss yourself into the abyss. Save yourself from an eternity encased in stone. No, thank you. Oh. I look like a serving maid. No, no. Wait, oh, can I go over here? Okay, let's... Can I blow this one out? Oh. 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 
Oh, and now it's closed? Is that what it is? I look no, like no. a serving maid. Over here. I see. Okay. So let's give him some more money. Uh. Watch. You're gonna have to jump into the abyss to proceed. Probably! <laughs> jump! Jump into the abyss! Alright, so then that removes the door. <laughs> well, once I... Oh! Oh no! Oh! Oh! Salt or pepper? Um, take, take both, I guess. Oh! Well, isn't this fascinating? Do I have to make him sneeze? Like, maybe I have to keep this on... He's not something I can... Pepper will make you sneeze. Uh, I can't do anything with it? So then I- well, I still want to snuff this out though, right? I think- oh no, I can't do anything to it now. What the fuck?! So I can't go back there now. Can I fill it the hourglass with like salt and pepper? No. Wait, do I combine them? Nope. Do I fill... Fill anything. Salt or pepper. So I have salt and pepper now. What does the frick does that mean? I'm assuming it means I make somebody sneeze with this pepper. Okay. Uh... No, let me touch. I want to touch! Is it still gonna do it? Yes, okay. <laughs> oh, shush, dude. Why can't I go back here now? That's really annoying. It's kind of weird that I can't, like... Like he's not a... Not an object. What about you? He's on April? No. I really can't take this, eh? I can't snuff it out? No. What if I exited? Do I maybe do that? Oh, honey. oh! Oh! Thank you so much for the follow! I'll see the name in a moment. Ice Nine, I appreciate that. Welcome on in. <laughs> I want to get to the door or the parchment or the anything. Huh. Have I got any ideas? I look like a serving maid. Yeah, I know, April. Um. There's a door here. I could go into the other place, but now I can't. Wait, do I snuff these out? No. I must have to combine something. I don't know what I would combine. Wait, maybe I can call Crow. He probably won't come flying in here, but... Doesn't hurt to try. Oh, nope, shit. Come on, Crow. Help me out, bro. I guess he's not around. I should try again later. Damn, okay. Hmm. Pepper. Pepper. Give me the pepper. Base. Gargoyle. Why can't I? Oh, I see. I can't go that way because it's. Can I like leave? Go anywhere else? I guess I could exit. Can't. No oh, shit! Blocked. Lorhan must have turned back into solid rock. No oh, shit. All right. Well, I okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, you're a jerk. All right. There's something I have to do here, and I just don't know what it is. Cause the game usually wouldn't trap me. I do have one coin. Can I? Can I? Oh, can I? Oh, 
What would I do if I was a teenager trying to save the world? Uh... I don't give the pepper to Constable Guybrush, do I? The monk? The monkey? I created a rift. It's working. I don't need to wind it again. Okay. What if I looked at it? The watch is ticking. Hmm. Do I fill the rolled up map with pepper? <laughs> Who cares? It's not even the real world. Ugh. <laughs> I mean, I much prefer this fantasy world, to be perfectly honest. It's more, uh, inviting. Wait, oh, maybe I use ski candy with something. I certainly don't eat it. I mean, I can have the pepper or the salt stick to it. No. But I was onto something with that. Uh, organic plant? Do I tickle them with something and then make them sneeze? Ah. Nope. Good night. Have a good night, Malthan. Thanks for popping in. I appreciate it. Do I just, like, line up the salt like cocaine with the card and just sniff it? <laughs> just snort the salt? Please don't do that, April. What the fuck do I do? <laughs> eh. Eh. Oh, oh, no. Damn it. What have I looked at? That again? gargoyle's holding a large hourglass. Yes, I know that, April. Hourglass. Hourglass. Okay. Gargoyle. Nothing clickable. Okay. Can't take these again, which is really weird. Wait, is it timed? I don't think I can do anything when I move it. Like, can I do that and then just run? Anytime today, April. You got this, girl. Go, go, go. It's timed. Ho! <laughs> Alright, I learned. I didn't think I could move, but there you go. Take this parchment. Whoa! Oh, okay. Talk about a hissy fit. Evil Mirror Universe April sure got some anger stored up. Guess she doesn't want me to get that parchment. Okay. All right. Well, we're not getting parchment, it's a I guess. Up parchment. Okay. Can I do anything with the salt and the pepper now? <laughs> Okay, that is an interactable object, so I can do something to her. Um, a door. Let's look at it's it. It's a stone door. D a door? Doesn't lead anywhere. Hello? Who's knocking? Oh. Whoa. Hi. An hourglass. Oh. Run. Run, girl, run! Oh god. Alright, well, let me open this door then. Bye! Balance be cast. I figured out your riddles and tricks, sir! Even though they weren't that hard to figure out. Um. Here I go. Oh god. That's one stony face. Uh, you want some. Pepper, make you sneeze. Let me use this place. Oh my god, I was kidding. Okay, so I wasn't too far off. 
Just a different door. <laughs> nice. Hills bell. Hills bells. I beat your tricks, wizard, alchemist, person. Ooh. Big, certainly, but I can't see anything through it. It's like there's a thick fog outside obscuring everything. Evil alchemist or not, at least he's made some effort to make the place look good. Yeah, that's, that's, that's true. It does look very nice. Ooh, a fireplace. Say whatever you want about Roper Clax, he certainly knows how to keep a big fire. Oh, wait. Are those human bones down there? Oh no. He's cooking humans alive. Uh, anything else? No, I guess we'll just... I guess I'll save. Made some good progress here. Uh, let's go up to the tower. Finally! <laughs> what? I was beginning to think you would never make it through my labyrinth. Oh, heck. Welcome to my humble home. Oh, hello. Do you like it? I had it built according to my own specifications by the most skilled architects of Arcadia. Mm. They have since become a permanent and quite attractive fixture of their own building, of course. Oh, rude. Oh, oh, shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Oh, but I forget my manners. I am, as I am sure you already know, Roper Clax. And you would be? Uh, April Ryan, pleased to meet you, sir. April Ryan, pleased to meet you, sir. Oh, but the kitten has manners. How precious. How very precious. I am tempted to not turn you into stone. You would make a spirited wife and mother to my demonic children. Oh my god, get but away no. from me. Go away. That's it gross. It would be more fun to destroy you. Oh, okay. He's a good voice actor. Um, Why did you trap the wind? Oh, right, the alchemist trapped the wind. That's why we had to go get him so we could sail to the continent. Ah, that's not okay. Yep, yep, yep. Why did you trap the wind? Why does the wolf eat the sheep? Um. I don't think you answered my question. Mm -hmm. Because I can, little girl. Because I can. And because of who I am. Because I am hungry. And because the time is right. I think you did it because you're insecure and you have to show off your petty magic to the world. Damn, Shut April. your pretty little mouth. I will devour you. I will... <clears throat> But we must not lose our self-control, must we? No, we must not. Why did you turn the people into stone? Why did you turn those people into stone? Questions, questions, questions! I do not need to explain myself to you, little bastard child! Do you know who your parents are? No, of course not! Too stupid! What? Yeah, I do. What? What do you know about my parents? The fuck are you talking about, old man? Suffer the little children. What? Oh, how I love that phrase. It is my life's philosophy. What? I like suffering, especially the suffering of innocent children. Okay. Their screams are so pretty. Their tears so salty. All right, calm down, dude. You're a real shit, Clax. Nice. I know you are. But oh my. What am I? <laughs> <laughs> I need an audio clip of that. That was good. <laughs> it's just the. I know you are, but what do I? <laughs> like the, <laughs> the confidence in his laugh. It's, oh, I need a voice. I need a. <laughs> I need a voice. I'm gonna make an, uh, a sad clip of that. <laughs> Prepare to be defeated. Wait, so I have to destroy his crystal? I don't even know where it is. All right. Prepare to be defeated. Oh my. Prepare to be defeated. Pa! Clichés. Is that the best you can do? Uh, no. Watch me. Yes. And you plan to do what? 
Witness the men who came before you with their weapons and their magic. Look what happened to them, turned to stone, each and every one of them for all eternity. Mm. I even own their souls now, and they will feed me and keep me strong for as long as I need them. How original. Been reading a lot of fairy tales lately, have we? Nice. Are we just gonna just like verbally abuse him? <laughs> Duh. Duh. Okay. Oh god. Um, um, I can't do anything. See? Ooh. I could scour your flesh off your bones in a second, little girl. Now, do you think you could defeat me? I'm just probably gonna challenge him for a. How about a proper challenge? Yeah, well, I can pull a rabbit out of a hat. Wait. Oh, th these are interesting answers. I was gonna say, why don't I challenge him to a thing of riddles? He likes- he seems to like games. Um... I can pull a rabbit out of a hat. Yeah, well, I can pull a rabbit out of a hat. Bitch. I can pull a hat out of a rabbit, what's your point? Ugh. Whoa, I've never seen that before. It is not a pretty sight, and I love it. Oh, calm down, Ugh. How did you do that? How did you do that? Alchemy, little girl, the most powerful magic. It was a spell of my own creation. I knocked it together only last night. Okay. How about a proper challenge? Hmm. A proper... <clears throat> what, what do you mean by a proper challenge? A game of riddles, let's go! I can't defeat you with magic, I'm not a wizard. Let's go! Wizards? All right. Frauds, the lot of them. The only real magic is the magic of alchemy. Yeah. But of course, you cannot defeat me with magic. That is why I will win. What's so great about beating me with magic? That's not a challenge. That's not a challenge. That's a walkover. If we even the odds out a bit, you'll have more fun and satisfaction from turning me into stone later. Okay. You are trying to trick me. I know that. But you intrigue me, little girl. The Go voice, on, his then. voice is Issue He's such a good voice actor. Oh, so good. Okay, so now I have to issue him a challenge. Uh, it's Roper Clax, your basic evil wizard and bad dresser. <laughs> the basic bitch. Oh, I challenge you to game of. Wait, what? I challenge you to give a hot scotch around a tic-tac-toe to a spelling bee. Oh wait. Oh, I can't get out of it. Damn. Okay. Give me a moment. Give oh. me a moment, and I'll think of a better challenge. I want to save. A oh. moment is all you get, little girl. Yeah, because I want to save. I want to try these. These are fun. Um. Save game. All right, Roper. What do we got? Come on. There we go. I give him a scotch, give him a tic tac toe to a spelling bee to guess my weight, to recite a monologue from Shakespeare's and Bad that challenges you to a cooking contest. Oh, hell fucking yeah. Well, actually, no, that, that'd be a bad thing. He's an alchemist. <laughs> All he does is cook. <laughs> he just, just a different kind of cooking. Um. Uh. Hopscotch. I want to see him play hopscotch. I challenge you to a game of hopscotch. Do not underestimate me, little girl. I was young <laughs> once too, believe it or not. And I was the neighborhood champion in hopscotch three years running. <laughs> what? Um, okay. Let's rock and roll. Oh my god. I'm gonna try a bunch of these now. What? <laughs> Wait, do I do something to mess them up? No. Fine, you win. <laughs> we have to cook, Jesse. Wait, can I do all of them? Fuck yeah, let's do it. <laughs> yes. Oh, take that down. Let's go. You. To a round of tic-tac-toe. Please tell me I can do all of them. Ah. 
<laughs> Did I forget to mention that back at the Alchemist's Academy, I was a faithful member of the Tic-Tac-Toe Club for five years. A faithful member, you say? Oh, really? Alright, let's see. What you got for me, dude? <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> oh god, I want this game to be just like... <laughs> just like... Just get new graphics. Fine, you win. Get re- um... Remade. And I want all of these options. And maybe even more. Um, it's a spelling bee. I challenge you to a spelling bee. It's ridiculous, and I love it. Ha! Spelling, my secret pattern. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> you begin. This man, it's Give the it most me. basic white boy. Um, sure, okay. Uh, um, spell bureaucracy. Okay. Bureaucracy, as in a body of non-elective government officials. Bureaucracy, B U R E A U C R A C Y. Bureaucracy. Nice. Now it's your turn. Spell Anzabekwakalia. Answer what? That's not a real word. It is here. It is. It is a terminology often used in the study of the black art of alchemy. Now spell it. A N <laughs> S I'll forget it. It <laughs> All right, what else we got? Guess my weight. I challenge you to guess my weight. 118 pounds. Huh. Damn. <laughs> Damn it. That's it. Uh, oh, let's see. Um, recite a monologue from I Shakespeare's you Macbeth. I recite a monologue from Shakespeare's Macbeth. <coughs> if it were done when it is done, then twere well it were done quickly. If the assassination could tremel up the consequence and catch with his surcease, success, that but this blow might be the be all and the end all. Mm. <laughs> Alright, we gotta cook. Let's go. Jesse! We have to cook! I <laughs> challenge you to a cooking contest. Ah, cooking. My secret passion. You, you mean have not you have multiple secret you passions? My mince pie. Dude, nice. Oh, brother. Forget cooking. I suck at cooking anyway. <laughs> Oh no! I don't have anything! Give me a moment, and I'll think of a better challenge. What? Oh, I a actually- The moment is all you get, little girl. Okay. Oh no. Uh, oh. So it has to be something with my inventory. Um. Uh. 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 Flip coin? Maybe? Let me collect the coin, please. I want to taste your mince pie. Don't don't take that out of context. <laughs> Hi, JPG. How are you? <laughs> Is that what you came into? <laughs> me saying I want your mince pie. <laughs> how you doing, JPG? <laughs> uh oh, God. I don't. Um. Hmm. Wait. Maybe he wants a calculator. Hey, dude. You want this? Look, it's magic science. I challenge you to a contest of yeah, I G P G using only this petty little device against your supreme intellectual powers. Yeah. Give me your best shot, but after this, I will take your soul and trap you in stone for all eternity. The stream's going well, thanks, G P G. This guy's voice actor is awesome, by the okay. way. Here's one. Forty-nine times eleven. 
49 times 11 what? Numbers. Okay, think of apples and oranges. 49 apples times 11 oranges. 49 times 11. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Carry the one over, divide by three. What to do with that file? <laughs> <clears throat> no, forget that one. So that leaves us with... Nine! Aha! <laughs> That's not correct. Wrong! It's 539. That was an easy one, Clax. Is that the best you can do? So he's bad at math, but he's an uh, alchemist? Two oh out of three. God. Oh my god. I'll give you an even easier one this time. 603 divided by three. Eh. Ooh, you underestimate my powers, little girl. 5,867.2.3. Aha! Oh my god. Way off, buddy. It's 201. Sorry, you lose. Sorry. Give me that thing. No, my calculator. Oh, God. Oh, you're a jerk. Give me my calculator back. Ooh. This is intriguing. This really is. What does this do? Oh. Oh my. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Cutscene time. You okay, dude? He's, he's, he's jiving. He's jimmying. Oh, he dropped it. Wh what? What? <laughs> Excuse me? I trapped his soul in a calculator. Oh no, you gave him math! Oh, oh no. Oh, this, oh. We're going into the sky. Bye! What? What? Why did that work? I don't get it. And I always thought math was such a waste of time. <laughs> okay. Neat. To the tower, I suppose. Um, are you going to be getting the Mario Kart DLC and playing with us? Ooh. Probably. I, 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 I imagine I will be. Um, I forget, was it, it wasn't free with online, right? But it was like some discounted thing online? I can't quite remember. Maybe it was free, I don't remember. Ooh, crystal. It's a crystal ball with tiny specks of light flitting back and forth inside. This must be where Clax has trapped the souls of all those unfortunate people. Yep, well, time to break it open with a rack, maybe. Rack? No. Uh. Push pin? No. Okay. I'll check. Yeah, there was something about it. I just couldn't remember. These yes. curtains haven't been washed in years. Typical. Evil alchemists spend too much time mixing potions and coming up with megalomaniacal schemes and not enough time doing basic household chores. Or math, apparently. Something behind the curtain. Clever fellow, that Roper Clax. Who'd think to look there? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Window. Uh, sure. The window's closed, and that glass is too foggy to see through. Open it, then. I don't know how high up we are, but there are clouds below us, and I can't see the ground. Oh, so I can just open and close it? Leave it open. A vial. Oh. It's a bottle containing white liquid. Sure. Let's take this. Hopefully it's nothing... Gross. Oh. He tore out a, a tome of alchemy. He tore out a page. This page has been torn out, leaving only part of it readable. If he bothered to tear it out, it must be important. Hmm. It's a spell. Oh my god. Clouds and spider's webs, plus, um, magic finger? If alchemy is anything Close like chemistry, running. that last one is probably some kind of catalyst or something. Clouds and spider web plus catalyst makes invisible? Oh, maybe. Clouds, spider webs, a 
Okay. Uh, what about Only here? part of this page is readable. Hmm. So this is all for spell. Okay. Clouds plus spider webs. I don't. Is the white liquid like? What is this? What the fuck? Listen. Smell. Touch. It sounds like distant thunder. Okay. <laughs> it smells like ozone. <laughs> it smells like ozone? It feels moist and light. Fluffy almost. Oh, so it's clouds in a bottle. So I need spider webs then. Probably. It sounds like distant thunder. Huh. Okay. Uh So I need what's this? A skull. It's a big old skull with a weird blue light inside. I want it. Give me the skull. It's 25 on its own, but it also comes with the Nintendo Switch Online plus Expansion Pass. We have that. Oh, I do! So it comes with it? Perfect. That, then I definitely have it. Oh, a vial! Uh, it's a bottle containing a blue liquid. So do I mix them? So I gotta look at the blue liquid now. Crystals? Glass? I can hear a distant tingling sound like crystal bells. Hmm. <laughs> it smells hard to define. Sharp, decisive, earthy. Crystal. Okay. It feels cool to the touch, like ice. Oh, it's okay. Okay, so I okay. So we have clouds and the crystal. I need webs. Oh. Oh, maybe this is where I boil it? It's a tap used for emptying the contents of the pot into a container. Oh, a yellow flask. Here we go. I want this. It's a bottle containing a yellow liquid. Alright, let's look at this now. This is gonna be the webs. It sounds like the rapid flapping of fragile wings. Oh. <laughs> Smells like fresh flowers. Oh. Huh. It feels soft like satin and very fragile. I mean, maybe it's webs? Maybe it's like natural stuff? Oh, yeah, because maybe like the soft lapping of wings is like the. Um. Oh, a vial. Is like. It's a uh, bottle containing a red liquid. Uh, it might be like uh, flies. I don't think I can reach it. Though. I can't reach that high. Yeah. Is there anything I can do to knock this over? I mean, I probably could work with what I have. Let's look at the book again. Okay, so white clouds, white plus yellow. Uh, I don't know if that's crystal. Maybe. White, yellow, blue? I can try that. I think I have to like combine them. Uh, okay. Let's go over here. How are you doing, by the way, GPG? Hope you're doing well. Alright, so white. Uh, white. Oh, it didn't do anything, did it? I'm gonna exit. Try this again. Okay, 
what are you? Wait. Oh no. Oops. That didn't seem to mix too well. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. So. So. So it is. It is three times. Okay. So then. Spiderweb was the second one, which I think was yellow. That didn't seem to mix too well. Okay, so it's not what I think it is. Okay. Uh, hmm. So do I need to throw something at that to get the... Wait, maybe Crow. Maybe he can get it for me. Because uh, maybe he'll come through the window? Yeah! Because then he can get the vial for me. That works. Yeah. What's going on? Nice digs you found here, though I'd cut down on the mad alchemist decor just a little. Just it's a just little. not you. It's just not me. I don't plan on sticking around, Crow. Hmm. Heck, why not? You'll be mobile. Home security is not an issue, and you can strike fear into the hearts of men. When you put it like that, no. Hmm. Hey. Up to you. So, why'd you call me? All right, uh, I could use some I help. I could use some help. I'll try my best. Just let me know what you want me to do. Mm-hmm. Get this Think thing. Think you can get that red flask for me, Crow? Unless you want me to knock it down for you? No way. It's too large and unhandy for my claws. Oh. Oh. But I... Oh. Uh. Uh. No. Crow might drop and break the bottle. That's fair. What do I do? Do I give him something? Uh, sticky candy? Stick to your feet? Maybe? What do I... Uh. It's a bottle containing a red liquid. I guess I could talk to him. It's Crow. I can't use him for anything else? Oh, I could send him out the win- Wait, I could send him out the window? That seems kind of weird. That's weird. I thought I could use him. Hmm. Need some fresh air, Crow? Go on. Go for a walk. You kicking me out of here? I thought you needed my help. I do. Yeah, I do. Sorry. Stick around. Weird. Okay. Wait. Do I close the window? Okay. Oh. Uh. I... What? What? When did I? All right, well, I totally missed that, I guess. Need some fresh air, Crow? Go on, go for a yeah. walk. So how do you want me to crash through the window? Head or ass first, mm -hmm. if you know what I mean. Eek, sorry. <laughs> so I've got Crow here. Let's let's look at the screen essence. Uh, maybe I gotta mix them. I can hear the rustling of tiny legs. Okay. <laughs> it smells like pearls of morning dew. Okay, so that's the spider web. It has the texture of thin strands of hair. Okay. Just who says eek? <laughs> April does, apparently. Okay, so maybe we'll just change this. So that's the spider one. The white one is... So then what was the third one? It was like a explosion? Crystal? So that's clouds. This is... So maybe we mix these two. No. Let's 
yellow essence. It sounds like the rapid flapping of fragile wings. I can hear a distant tingling sound like crystal bells. Hmm. I could try it. Oh no, don't leave. Just who says eek. Apparently April Ryan does. Uh, okay, so this is... Correct. Oh wait, no. Oh, I already messed it up. Oops. No, 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 no. Clouds first. Clouds? Do spider. Oh, I already missed it. That didn't seem to mix too well. I guess it saves whatever the last one was. I love that she's like, whoops, guess that didn't mix too well after like making an explosion. It's like, nothing happened. I didn't do anything. It's fine. Alright, then we do the spider. And then the crystal explosion? Oh, no. Which I think is blue? Oh! It worked! I'll just pour the finished potion into one of these vials. Okay. So I got invisibility. Nice. Like so. Fortunately, they're small enough to carry in my pocket. That's good. Alright. Invisibility potion. What's that gonna get me? Can I- are there any other pages I can flip through? Tome of Alchemy. No. Okay. So, what if I used it on the crow? Not that it really- or me, maybe. He's on April. He's on April. Okay. I'll save it for when I really need it. What did that do? <laughs> I want. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? I. Uh... It's crow. I know it's crow. What do I put him on? Have him pex a crystal? Big book. Can I cook the bird? Do I mix this with something? Apparently, I, I, I must have this for later, I guess. It's a bottle containing a red liquid. I can't reach that high. Yeah, so what do we do? I have to give something to Crow. Um, what could I do that would keep it in place? Uh, sticky candy doesn't work. Bond of stone won't work. Uh, monkey. Constable Guybrush, hello? It's Constable Guybrush. My toy? Ape. Uh... She didn't write anything down, did she? Nope. I can go back to the cauldron and mix some things. I don't know if that'll work, though. Can I mix two invisibility potions? Now I'm curious if I do that. What will two invisibility potions get me? Okay. And then this one. 
Nah, I already got that potion. I'm pretty certain I won't be needing any more. Like, maybe there's another book I'm missing. Like, maybe he had... Look, he's got all these books. Can I go downstairs? I can. Okay. Maybe there's something I'm missing. this yet? Oh, the parchment. Right. I might be able to grab nah, it now. Nah, I don't trust my mirror image. She's a bad girl. I gotta do something it's my mirror image? Up parchment. Maybe I have to get that. Oh, wait. Invisibility potion. Use it now. She won't see you. Ah, okay. I'm invisible. That's so cool. Neat. Uh, then we go grab this. That's actually kind of a cool way to do it. Nice. Okay. So what is it? Solid again. Good timing. I've got to hold on to this stuff. If nothing else, it's perfect for sneaking into clubs back home. Hmm. Well, what do we get? Oh, it's the torn page. Wonderful. Okay. Man, this game is so forgiving. All right. Let's read this. It's a page that's been torn out of a book. Well, that's... From the intricate schizophrenic handwriting and the frighteningly detailed illustrations, I'd say it came from a spell book. I could be wrong, but... No. Wait, what do I... No? Uh, can I, I, I can't decipher it, is, is that the problem? It's the missing page from Roper Clax's big book of alchemy. Okay, can I not read it? What the fuck? Do I, do I have to show it to me? No. Huh? Eh? Do I burn it? Wait, what if I look at the big book? Oh, okay, maybe I do this. There we go. Holy shit, okay. Uh, so we got butterfly plus that one equals, okay, plus clouds. Clouds plus, I don't know, equals wind. Oh, what the fuck is that last one? The guardian? Explosion. Uh, I probably want wind? I don't want an explosion. Probably want wind. Because then that'll maybe help blow it off? I don't know. Unless leaf does something, I could make leaf. So flapping plus clouds plus crystal equals leaf. Okay. Let's try that. I think this one's flapping. Yeah. It sounds like the rapid flapping of fragile wings. Okay. So flapping plus clouds, oops, plus uh, crystal. I can do that. Alright. So flapping. Plus clouds. Plus crystal. That will make a leaf. I'll just pour the finished potion into one of these vials. Green. Oh, it's purple. Okay. Ooh. Light as a leaf potion. Oh! Okay. I want to do the other ones, though. The 
clouds plus uh, the other one plus crystal. Web. What was this one? That was butterfly. I don't think I can do this yet. Okay. What ones can I do with just butterfly? Web plus butterfly equals that one. I can do that. Okay. So I'll just explode one, I guess. Doesn't really matter. That didn't seem to mix too well. Okay, so, uh, web. Web is this one. Plus butterfly, which is this one. And, uh, crystal. I don't know what this makes, but we'll see. I'll just pour the finished potion into one of these vials. Alright, what do we got here? Bind magic. Oh. Alright, well, we I can give you the light as a leaf potion. No, I can give it to the I don't know how to do that. I'll just take a tiny little sip. Okay, could I reach it now? Do I float? Ooh, bitter. I do feel a little less weighty. Nice. If I put my mind to it. Yay, book reading simulator. Careful! We already the magician says neat. Yeah, so I, I finished the Banda place and I defeated the magician, so that's kinda cool. I'm gonna grab this vial. I'm doing, uh, making potions right now. Yeet! Woo! Alright. Whoa! I should save some of this stuff for the Olympic Games next year! It's a safe bet. I dominate the high jump and pole vault contests. <laughs> How you doing, by the way, Kapil? Nice to see you. This is probably the, the Earth, Earth Essence kind of stuff. So, I want to make... I mean, I want to make that one, but, uh, okay. So, clouds, red, white, red, blue. Okay. White, red, blue. White. The magician's voice actor, by the way, or the alchemist, was awesome. I love him so much. <laughs> He was so funny. Red. And blue. I think that does the wind thing, like I can give wind back. I'll I wanna just try the explosion the though. Potion into one of these vials. <laughs> Yeah, there was- oh no, there was one that made like a symbol? This one. No, I did that one, didn't I? Oh, that was magic bind. Yeah, I already made that one. So then the last one is this exploding one. So, red, red, uh, crystal. And 
crystal. Here we go. Now I can make explosions. I can be Shameless Finnegan. I'll just pour the finished potion into one of these vials. There we go. Okay. Alright, so now we have Big Bang Potion, Wind Potion, Bind Magic, Light as a Leaf. Nice. I think it was only four. And then plus invisibility. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I want any crow to do anything. I could give him the... Well, let me open this window. Maybe he can blow the wind back. But I can't do it? I don't know. Maybe I can. So if I say wind potion and I give it to me, oh, I can. Oh, I give it to Crow. Okay, what, what, what do I give it to I'll me? I'll save it for when I really need it. Hey, Crow. Yeah, Crow needs it. Okay. Hold on to this vial, okay? Oh, sure. Holding on to stuff is a specialty of mine. What for? I'll let you know. Now go for a... go. Go, go, go fly. I want you to fly out there, Crow, as high as you can and empty the potion into the clouds. Yeah. Oh, what if there's lightning? I don't like lightning. Lightning has caused better birds than me to crash and burn. All right, all right, I'll do it. I'm the ever faithful crow. That you are. Cutscene. Uh oh, I guess it's working. Uh oh. That's done with. There's still quite a bit left in the bottle in case you need it later on. Well, that's good. Okay. Um. So the wind's back. I think we're still floating, though. That's a problem. And I still need to release this crystal. <laughs> oh, Big Bang? Maybe I'd use that. That makes sense. We'll, we'll blast the crystal open. just fizzled. The crystal seems to be in constant fluctuation. Mm. Maybe that's preventing the explosive potion from being effective. Oh. I'll save it for when I really need it. Oh. It's got a what? I'm no sorcerer, but I think I have Oh, to, bind magic. Uh, oh. Pacify the magic I get it. I get you, I get you. Yes, yes, yes. Here we go. Bind magic. There we go. And now we use it. Oh, damn. Oh. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, the gargoyles, too, eh? Ooh. You're free, people! Oh god. Don't let go, dude. <laughs> okay. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Whee! <laughs> that looks so silly. Oh, we're gonna crash. Uh oh. Hold on for dear. Hold on to your butts! <laughs> oh, you got quite the ass, sir. Jesus. Oh god! Oh, he's okay. He's fine. Oh, thank gosh. Okay. He's fine. Oh, I guess we were okay too. That's good. I'm just walking. Can I land a pl- Uh, land a castle? Uh, farmhouse. Rustic. Reminds me of home. Well, I need to go talk with him, don't I? Uh, is he- maybe he's just okay. Cause he, he landed in the fields. Maybe he's okay. Monumental. Okay. Well, if, 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 if he's fine, I guess we'll just move on. Now, actually, mm, no, nah, it's fine. I'll go to the pier. Because uh, I was thinking about that bridge I couldn't cross.
Hold on. How? Oh, am I just not able to go there at all anymore? Is that what it is? City green, pier. Okay. Let's go to the pier then, I guess. Hello? Hello? Assorted cargo. Blue man group? Hey, dude. I, I did it. Captain Nebeve? Huh? Oh, it's just you. Where have you been? Where have I... Don't you remember? I went north to find Roper Clax and get him to release the wind. And I did. Oh, I... You know, the wind did pick up mysteriously last night, Oh, but, what a uh... jerk. But what? I don't trust it to not die down in a few hours. Or at the most, a day or two. Oh my god, really, dude? But I destroyed the alchemist. I even set his prisoners free from the rock they were trapped in. Destroyed the soul stone. Sailed back here in his floating castle and... And you don't believe a word of it, do you? <sighs> not a word. Oh my god. Great. I did defeat Roper Clax. I did defeat Roper Clax. Uh-huh. Do you have his severed head somewhere on you? I have his... I beat him. I didn't say I killed him. Well, his soul is trapped in a calculator, did. but I didn't pick that up. Can we set sail for Elias now? He won't, he won't do it. Well, the wind has picked up a bit, but I don't trust the good weather to last. Ugh. I don't want to be sitting dead in the water come tomorrow afternoon. So I'll wait a few days more. Thanks for nothing. What the fuck? What do I do? Captain Nebeve? What do I do huh? to convince him? Oh, it's just you. Again. What do you want? I, I guess I have to show him that I defeated Thanks Roper. For nothing. I don't have the the calculator anymore, though. I didn't pick it up. Oh, no. I have a... Wait, wait, but I have vials. He just sucks. What if, what if I showed him the wind potion? Captain Nebeve? Huh? I got something you want. What? Well, out with it, girl. What is it? Wind potion. Oh, nothing. You do remember our deal, don't you? Let's go to Stark. Let's this guy wait his days. Yeah, really. Um, remind me what the deal was again. That if I defeated Roper Clax and brought the wind back, you'd give me a lift to the Isle of Elias. <laughs> sure. <laughs> the day I see a girl like you bring down a powerful alchemist like Clax is the day I hire a woman to be my navigator. Well, hire me well, as a navigator, because check this out. Hey, By girl. the balance, girl, that's a strong grog you got there. What is it? Tyron spice wine? Did he drink it? It's the wind. Watch this. <laughs> Chow, that's a strong wind. You got some mighty powerful magic there, girl. Nice. And there's more where that came from. Uh huh. Care to share some of it with us? With that magic, we could make good time to Guillen. Pick up a cargo full of apples and be back here before the competition got uh, wind of what was happening. Indeed. Sure. If you give me a ride to Elias, as promised. Mm hmm. Balance be cursed. Women aboard? When will it ever end? Jowls, bowels. Be here by this afternoon, or we'll sail without you. Afternoon? Okay. As if you'll get far without my wind magic. And you did say something about hiring a female navigator? Mm-hmm. Damnation! Do you insist on remembering every little thing I say, girl? Don't you know that Jal has forbidden women from riding the waves? Ah, you're a sexist pig. Sounds like a bunch of sexist bullshit to me. Yep. But it's your choice. I got the wind in my pocket. Now you learn to treat women with a little respect. Hell yeah. I've run out of curses, girl. Jal be damned I am in desperate need of a navigator anyhow. So I need to get the... All right, all right. Yeah. You be here by this afternoon with, with your, your navigator. navigator. Yeah, okay. It's not as if I ever put much faith in the teachings of the drunken prophet Jal myself. Mm. The drunken prophet. Okay, so I think she said that, like, I mean, I have to, okay. She, the innkeeper said that they were by the docks, but I, I never ran into her. Oh, the, he's gone. Oh, okay. Um, 
guess I'll just go over here. I, I never saw her. And I can't talk to these people. So I guess I'll go to the city gates. I could go back to the inn to ask. Because I thought they said that she was by the pier looking for boats. The she wasn't having any luck. Maybe she's outside of the pier. Uh, box. Hmm. Uh, oh, can I just... If I go into the city gates, will it let me do the... Let me do the thing? Yes, okay. Uh, do any minute. Alright. Oh? Hello? Hi. Um. Okay. I'm gonna go in then. Bye! Oh. Hello? You're not who I meant to see. The back rooms are both empty. Hello? Well, oh. Hi. Pardon me, ma'am. I'm sorry, young woman, but I do not wish to speak with anyone presently. Ooh, I like your voice. Oh. It's a blue woman. And you know, no big deal. I've seen it all. A blue woman is just run of the mill now. Ma'am? Please, leave me be. I do not wish to speak with anyone. Oh. Um. Is this yours? Pardon me for intruding, ma'am. But is your name Tunlayak? Yeah. Yes. I'm Tunlayak. I have a delivery for you. Oh. A map of the Northlands. I had almost forgotten I ordered it. Sorry about that. I came by a few days ago, but you weren't here. Hmm. No, no, I was looking for work. <sighs> Thank you kindly, young woman. I will need this map now, if I am to make it to Khorasan by foot. Okay. Why are you going to Khorasan by foot? Why are you going to Khorasan by foot? I can ill afford the cost of passage on a ship bound for the Bay of Fire. And since I do not have a job, nor the prospect of getting one, I have little choice. Mm. Uh, are you from Coruscant? Are you from Coruscant? No, I am from the Southlands. I have never been to Coruscant. Mm. Then why are you going there? Because I am told that in Coruscant, Captains allow women to join their crew. Here, in Mercuria, they do not. Great. So I've been told, but you shouldn't have to go somewhere else to get a job. That just isn't fair. True. Fair or not, it is custom. And custom is a difficult thing to change. Hmm. Why are you so depressed? Why are you so depressed? Is it that apparent to you? I do beg your pardon. It was not my intent to burden you with my dark mood. It's okay, I don't mind. I'd like to help if I can. Yeah. I do not think you can. Unless you were the captain of a ship, and you could hire me as your navigator. Well, but you, you say not. that. And so you cannot help me. Uh, actually, you're a navigator? You're a navigator? Yes. And I have a letter to prove it. Do you want me to show it to you? Yes, give me the letter so I can no, give it I to the dude. You. And you're looking for a job? Uh. I have been looking, now, for many moons. But most captains do not want women on their crew. And so I am leaving for Coruscant in the morning. Mm. I got a job for you if you want it. I got a job for you, if you want it. A job? As a navigator? Yeah, on a boat called the White Dragon. We're leaving this afternoon, if you're interested. If you are serious, then yes. I am more than interested. But will the captain allow a woman as his navigator? Uh, I'll make him. This one will. Do it. Trust me. Yep. Because if he doesn't, he's not going anywhere. Just pack your stuff and head down to the docks. Mm -hmm. Talk to Captain Horatio Nebeve of the White Dragon. Tell him I sent you. The name's April Ryan. Hell yeah. Thank you, April. I am Tun Layak. I am most grateful to you. Will you be going with us? Heck yeah, I will. Yeah, so I'll see you there. 
Thank you so much. I love you. <laughs> oh, you're so cool looking. I love you. Alright. Alright. Uh, doesn't look like anything else I can do, so let's head back. Head into the ship. Head into the boat. Here. Oh. Hello? Uh... It's the white dragon. Hello? Horatio? Do I have to come back later because it's not the afternoon? Oh. That kind of sucks. Okay. Wait, do I use my... Wind potion? Anywhere? On the sails? On the boat? On the... no? I'll save it for when I really need it. Don't I want to head out? <laughs> okay... So there's something else I gotta do. Okay... He's still not here. Okay. Okay. Don't know who these two are. Run as fast as your little legs can carry you, April. Uh, the gates. West has his bungalow, city green. I guess I'd go to the Enclave. Maybe they'll tell me more about... I can put the... St maybe the stone? Or... Mm, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Ah. Although it looks like it might fit, I think I'll hold on to it until I have all four pieces of the disc. Okay, fair enough. Uh, hey dude. Let's talk. I don't know if there's anything else you can prove to me, dude, but... Oh! Oh, goodness. It's you again. April, you're very you close to this land. Fright. Could I see some more books? Oh, certainly. What a silly question. Information, silver spoon. Actually, yeah, okay. I don't feel like reading right now. Don't feel like very well. Though <laughs> it is the strangest thing I've heard in a while. <laughs> How can you not feel like reading? Oh, I I wish, I wish I could be like that again. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. Uh, yes, yes, good, good. So, can I, like, do anything to this? It won't budge! Light as a leaf, invisibility, find magic, and wind. Light as a leaf? Maybe? No. I'll save it for when I really need it. I thought if I poured something on it, it would work. It's not got bind magic on it, right? No. Ah. Ah. Yep, didn't write anything in her journal? No, she didn't. Okay. Huh. I feel like I probably missed something? I can do anything else here. Can I touch the pool? The water is pretty cold. Mm. I probably have to do this when I. It's a rusty wheel. I don't have anything to, like, take the rust off. I probably have to come back here when I have all the stones. Or 
perhaps. do I do? Well, I guess I could return to the map seller. I did return his map. Maybe the um, sailor will be here. No, he will not. There you are. There we go. I mind to fire you. I expect you still haven't delivered the map of the Northlands to Tun Lyak at the Journeyman Inn. No, I did. I took care of that delivery ages ago. Really? Well, then I can finally fire you. Nah. You're the most incompetent errand boy I've ever had. Give me the delivery list and get out of here. Ouch. Uh, I think I left that list somewhere far away. Ye gods, not only do I have to deal with your incompetence, but now the guild will skin my hide and hang it up to dry. Maps. Okay. Remember me? I'm trying my very best to forget, believe me. <laughs> okay. I don't have that anymore? Oh, I guess I don't. Okay. So... Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I can go talk to the priest? I still think I have to go back to the forest. But I don't know how to get there, because I don't remember how I got there in the first place. Oh, he's not even here! Okay. Uh... Hmm. Priest and rider. Alright, well, maybe we'll go check out West House? I need to let the time pass, which makes me think I need to go back into Stark. But... Let's try... Oh. A bottle. I can't hold my liquor. I'll be spending the rest of the day doubled over, staring into the ocean, and, uh... It's a brown, slightly cloudy liquor. Huh. Mr. Westhouse? Sir? Are you in there? I guess he's not home. He really should lock up. But then again, how many people know somebody's actually living down here? Probably nobody. Alright. No Westhouse. No... Uh... Tobias. Um... I go talk to my favorite dude? I don't know if he'll have anything to offer, but... Nobody's home. Okay. Huh. Can I go back to the farmhouse? I don't think so. Like, to the forest? I don't... I don't think so. Yeah, it's not an option anymore. Um... Okay. Hmm. So I can do stuff at the enclave. I couldn't really do anything at the pier. Unless I missed something at the city gates. I'm not in the market for an instrument. That's fine. Can I use the shift thing? Hmm. I can't do anything with the bond of stone. Do I? Oh. Hello! 
Well, it is 3.35 a.m. I think I'll have to head to bed now. <laughs> no problem, Leia. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate that. I hope you have a good sleep. A good long sleep. How are you doing, by the way, Roxanne? I don't know if Benji's here. If Benji is here, would you mind giving Roxanne a shout out? And if not, I'll give her a shout out myself. Thank you, Benji. Let's see what clip we got. That's a bop! That's a bop! <laughs> I love it. Hell yeah. I'll save it for when I really need it. But I want to leave now! How do I... There's something here. To the back. Here we go. Uh. Tobias, are you here? Here he is. You have returned Whoa. from your trip north. It is good to see you again. I was concerned. Hey, Tobias. You're worried about little old me? That's sweet. And guess what? I kicked some alchemist ass while I was up there. Bet you didn't think I'd be able to do that. <laughs> then you have lost your wager. I knew you would. After all, you are... I was worried because of the trouble in the West. There's something that people aren't telling me about me. What trouble? Or, what do you mean after, you, after all you are... What did you mean when you said, after all you are... Hmm. Forgive an old man his misgivings, April, but I should have trusted you before. Oh, okay. Of course you should have. With what? With the truth. That you are the one who will watch well, what? us for a thousand years. What? That you are of the balance, and the balance is in you. Well, that you are the one born into the heaviest duty of them all. Uh... You are the guardian to be. What? The thirteenth guardian of the balance. What? No, 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 no. No. No, that's a lie. What? I'm not your guardian. That's not possible. Yeah, that's rude. No. It is certain. I had my doubts, unfortunately. It could have cost us the balance, and I made a mistake. But you gotta get the old guardian. But it is certain now. You are stronger in the balance than anyone before you. Oh, come on. God damn, Cortez, he didn't say anything about... If I'd known, I wouldn't have come here. I would have... I don't know what I would have done, but I what? wouldn't have come MV3. here. <laughs> maybe he did not know. Or maybe he did. And he knew it would be wiser not to tell you. But I am telling you now because you cannot stay here. You are too valuable. You must leave. Hmm. Uh... I'm leaving Elias this afternoon. I am leaving for Elias this afternoon. Yeah. Good. The Tyran are not a seafaring people. And the islands are probably the safest place to be right now. Okay. Before you go, I want to give you something to carry with you. I spent the night looking for it in the Enclave. It has been gathering dust for over 10,000 years. Okay. Oh, Tobias, I can't accept anything that old. Jesus. You are not accepting it. It is yours. The fathers have only kept it safe for the day when the thirteenth guardian would come to collect it. And now you are here. Please, take it. Okay. Thank you. It is the talisman of the balance. Known to but a few. Okay. It is mentioned in one text only. The scriptures of reunification. Eh. One of the thirteen scriptures of the balance. Okay. What does it do? The scripture speaks not of its purpose, but it is yours, whatever it is. I am certain it will help you once you find its purpose. It has strong magic. Very strong. Very strong. Thanks, Tobias. I really do appreciate it, even though I wish I didn't have to accept it. That's a you quick are the realization. Guardian, child. Your yes. fate is both glorious and terrible. But it is your fate. If you deny it, you deny our future. But I have faith in you, April. 
That's what I'm afraid of. What if I screw up? The balance provides. The balance protects. Trust the balance and trust yourself. Goodbye. And good luck on your journey. Okay. Thanks, Tobias. That was a quick acceptance for her, though. I thought she'd be like, fuck that. Alright, what do you got here? Uh, not this one. Next one. Wednesday morning, August 2nd, 2209. Bestrom Tobias told me that I am the guardian to be, uh... Okay. Vestrum, sorry. <laughs> Cats distract me. Vestrum Tobias told me that I am the guardian to be, the 13th such, and that my fate is to watch over the balance for a thousand years. You don't just toss something like that without, out without warning or, or some consideration to the fact that I'm just a normal person. I mean, if I'd been raised knowing that someday I'd have to go to some tower in the middle of nowhere and stay there for 1,000 years, then maybe... Just maybe. Out of, oh, Jesus! Ah! SDK Baby, hello! Hello! <laughs> safe let provide, safe let protect. Bam! Welcome! <laughs> hi, hi, SDK. Oh my god, how you doing? Oh, it's so nice to receive a raid from you. I do. I, I, I was gonna say we don't stream very often at the same time. That's awesome. What were you streaming? Um, Benji, would you mind giving a shout out to, to SDK? Long time buddy from Tumblr days. <laughs> How are you? What were you? What were you streaming? How is everybody? Ooh, you're doing it just chatting. I'm like on the spawn where you spawn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this spawn screen is lasting a long time. Well, that looks like an yeah, older I don't clip. Know that bosses, I don't know why. Maybe. Actually, I'm gonna go oh, look at I spawned with like 50 health. No, oh, no. Yeah. It because they do that, I'm going down here and go with the nurse so I can get oh. I think it just spawned inside my body. What is this game? You is this Terraria? Oh god. Eh. <laughs> nice. That's an old clip. Nice. I was doing a special Valentine's Day stream. Ooh. We did Boyfriend Dungeon, then we did a horror game. Lol. <laughs> the best Valentine's uh, game genre. The horror variety. <laughs> ah, finally. I figured out the bug. What what bug were you figuring out? Um, that's awesome, SDK. I really want to play Boyfriend Dungeon. Uh, what what horror game was it? Like a like a rando one, or was it like a well well known ish one? I think the last horror game I played was I didn't beat it, but Silent Hill Two. <laughs> I did stream that, and that was kind of fun, but uh, did not finish because it was a one off for the most part. Turns out. If you have two rigid body components in a parent-child set, it negates the uppermost one. Are you talking about oxygen not included? Or, um... Uh... Uh, Kerbal? I mean, I know you're playing Project Hospital lately, but I, I don't know what bug you're figuring out. Unity. Oh, are you, are you, are you making a game? You working on stuff? So you have... You have to have meshes on the children and then a rigid body component on the parent. I have no idea what you're talking about. I very nice. I understand nothing about <laughs> programming lingo. It was a puppet combo game. Eh, so it was very like 80s inspired. Well, nice. <laughs> well, um if anyone uh is new here, uh we're playing we're playing a, a 90s point and click adventure game called The Longest Journey. We're just coming up to, I think, the end of Chapter 5. We're actually just reading a diary entry that we got. Um, and uh, we're it, it, it's a game where uh, you are April Ryan. You're a young woman who, can, who finds out that she can shift between the world of magic and the world of, well, reality and science and boring things. Um, and she learns that she's the chosen one to save the world and, like, find the Guardian and all this stuff. Um, so... We actually just learned that she has been told that she is, in fact, the new guardian, and she's trying to deal with that shiz. Um, young woman. <laughs> Collider's not much, so okay. <laughs> um, and uh, we, we took down a, an alchemist. Like a, like a, uh, we, he was in a floating castle 
We decimated him by, like, with, with math. <laughs> he couldn't do math. And then we sucked his soul into a calculator. <laughs> I don't really know why, but it happened. <laughs> and we made a bunch of potions, and now we're back, and we're, 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 um, trying to set sail for passage to a new place, so. Anyway, we're, uh, I'll, I'll finish up reading this thing, and then we'll, I'll show you more of the game. Um, where was I? I'll just start from the top. Bestrom Tobias tells me that I'm the guardian to be, the thirteenth such, and that my fate is to watch over the balance for a thousand years. You don't just toss something like that out without warning or some consideration to the fact that I'm just a normal person. I mean, if I'd been raised knowing that someday I'd have to go to some tower in the middle of nowhere and stay there for a thousand years, then maybe, just maybe, I'd been able to deal with that. Not like this. Not like this. <laughs> Fucking Game Grim Sonic. Uh, this is just so not fair. I mean, I had plans for my life. I have friends. Not a lot, but a few. A family? Whatever I mean to them at this point. At least they're around. In a thousand years, there'll be nothing left for me, but nothing to remind me of me. I'll be lost and alone. I don't know if I can deal with that. But then what choice do I really have? What choice do any of us have? You always have a choice, April. There's our girl. There's April. This game is from the 90s, by the way, so it's a little... A little old-looking. A little polygonal. P polygonal. Do you still have the alchemist calculator? I don't! She left it. She didn't... There was no option to pick it up. Or at least not that I realized. I'm gonna save, by the way. Because it wasn't a clickable object, so... Alright, so now I think we can just go to the pier and set sail. Polygamous? <laughs> Polygonal. <laughs> Polyamorous? <laughs> Let's go to the pier. Alright, there is Captain Neveway. Finally. Hello, my dude. We are ready. And we must away before it's too late. We still have another six or seven hours of daylight today. Come, come aboard. Okay. Did I tell you how much I hate water? I didn't know that. No. Well, remind me to tell you sometime. Polyethylene. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's move the cursor. Cutscene. It's as big as a whale, and it's about to set sail! Go west! <laughs> you can't explore the seven seas! <laughs> off, off, and away, April. Here we go. Up, up, and away. It's quite the ship. Quite the sh- Whoop! Chapter 6. The Chaos Storm. Is Phoenix shirt in your Follow Alert canon? It absolutely is, Roxanne. <laughs> oh, God, my oh, hold guts on. have been cleaned out and I still feel sick. Oh, dear. <sighs> oh, that, oh. That, oh, God, that makes me a little queasy. Ugh. What? Yeah, so in... I think it's in the third game. But it's it's a young Phoenix. It's a, it's a, it's a flashback case. I think it's in the third game. Uh, oh shit. Why does the horizon have to keep rolling back and forth like that? Ugh, I don't know, but I don't want to look at it that long. Ugh. That's the cargo hold, and crew quarters down there. My bed's conveniently located right below the opening, to accommodate for those refreshing saltwater showers. Well, that's fair. Well... We just started chapter 6, and it is about 10 o'clock on the dot. So, I think it might be a good place to end for now. And I'll come back to this next week. Hopefully next week. Hopefully my workload isn't, like, freaking crazy. Uh, so let's, let's save. Let's do a little save real quick. Uh, there we go. New slot. Okay. 